ziua! Bună ziua! Din România! Good afternoon, and we're in Romania. And in response to your... Video contest. Video, yeah, video contest. We are preserving fruit and raspberries here. What do we have here? What was it called? Smeurat. And here we're also making from lemons. Limoncello, which is quite a um, well-known digestive from Italy. From Italy, and we have lemon, uh, 12 lemons peeled here with half a liter of pure alcohol. And this is the rose hip wine we've made. We have rose hips, sugar, water, yeast. So how much fruit have we got, Bonnie? Two kilos. Two kilos. Which we will, we will wash now. Okay, so that's our two kilos of fresh raspberries, and Tony is just washing them here. As you can see, just giving them a quick rinse in cold water. And we just picked out the bad ones, and any ones that had that. Or any bugs, like the caterpillar here. Like this little guy here. And we didn't have time to make another video, but we're also going to preserve plums and make tsuika, which is a Romanian drink, which is like a, uh, it's a Romanian version of a pooch. Mm. Joanna, I can really tell <laughs> these will make very, very delicious, delicious. So what happened? So Smell rata. Smell rata. Smell rata. Smell rata. Yes. The smell rata. Smell rata. English raspberry. English raspberry. Okay, so we're just doing a layer of raspberries and a layer of sugar, like it's on raspberry. Just use all the sugar here. Okay. And then that's the last layer. Of raspberries, Joanna is putting on here. So I don't know if you can see, but there's a layer: sugar, raspberry, sugar, raspberry, sugar, raspberry. And then to this, we're going to leave this for six to seven days, sealed, and then after that, we add half a liter of one liter, one liter of pure alcohol. 90, 90 degrees alcohol. Ninety percent alcohol. And a liter of water. 90% alcohol and a liter of water. And leave it two more weeks, three to four more weeks. In Romanian, doa e tre saptamana. We're just going to cover it with cling film and then a jar of lid. There we go. So we have this, which is called. And this? Limoncello, which is Italian, not Romanian. And we have our rose hip wine. But just to show you quickly, this is. So we tried to seal this here with plastic. We didn't have a proper lid. And um, would you like to explain what this is? Oh, I think you can do that better than me. Oh, okay. Well, we tried to seal this with plastic. Oh. With plastic. So this is fermenting at the moment and then um, so the CO2 escapes and then we've just got a little bottle here with water and then so the CO2 escapes through and bubbles through the water. So that's what that is there. It's all all very homemade and stuff but we hope it turns out good. Oh that's gonna take a long time. Good month or so still to ferment. Oh, we did add a little bit of lemon to the roast hip wine, and we will add oh. vanilla to well, our smaurata. Okay, smaurata. So you can always add something to change the flavors, to make your own flavors. Oh, that's what we're doing anyway. Okay. La bye bye. <laughs> also, these here. 
uh, rose hips, which I cut in half. Lots of rose hips that we didn't use for the wine, cut in half, and the seeds were taken out. We're going to use them for tea. I've just left them to dry, to dry in the sun for a wee while. But not sure if it's best to leave the whole rose hip for the seeds or not. 